Welcome back to Joe Wolf Field. It's the bottom of the second inning, no score. It'll be C.J. Price leading off for the Steeplecats, followed by Noah Vaughn and then Kyle Brennan. So C.J. Price leading off for the Steeple Cats. In the bottom half of the first inning, Mike, Daniel Holst was able to lead off, but the Blue Sox were able to strand him. And the first pitch misses for Price to Price 1-0, and how huge is that? And I'll tell you, he really disrupted the Blue Sox defense, um, caused the catcher Stubbs to get a pass ball and a throwing error. All in one play as he went all the way from first to third. Without the ball being put in play, and Price pops it up into left field, and the catch is made by Hezekiah Randolph. One away. And Brody Leftridge almost overthrew Zach Goldstein, so it would have been a comedy of errors that would have left nobody from the Blue Sox laughing had that happened. Comedy of errors on the in terms of the fact that only the Steeple Cats would be laughing. And you'd be laughing, too. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. All right, here's Noah Vaughn. That's in there for a called strike. Nothing in one. The 0-1 pitch fouled away back to the screen. Nothing in two. So the 0-2 pitch is going to be grounded to first, and they're going to throw back over to Tui, who is overcovering, and that's in time for out number two. So two quick outs to start the bottom of the second. Two big quick outs if you're Blue Sox. Nice play by Donovan. It looked like his plant foot slipped a little as he started the run, but recovered nicely, and Tui very good at getting over to the first base bag. Batter will be Kyle Brennan. Brennan, the designated hitter tonight, was the catcher yesterday alternating with John Mazza, who's catching tonight. And the pitch is inside for a strike one and 0-1. Oh and In there for a strike 0-1. Oh the 0-1 oh pitch. Swing and a miss 0-2. Oh and, and Brennan behind the plate yesterday had quite a game. No balls and two strikes. And the pitch misses for a ball one and two. He was the only Steeplecat really defensively that had had trouble fighting the lights on pop-ups. The brightness at McKenzie Stadium was an issue yesterday. But it had no effect on Kyle Brennan as he swings and misses for strike three. And one, two, three, go the Steeple Cats. No score as we go to the top of the third inning. Back after this on the NECBL Broadcast Network. <laughs> 